So let me show you what I ordered. Let's unbox this together. <laughs> yeah, I've been wanting to own one of these fragrances from Mason Margiela. This is by the fireplace. And this is an other toilet. The other product I order is this um, Tone 4 Shade and Illuminate Contour Duo. Oh my God, I've been wanting to own one of these. Let me see. Uh, the other product I order is this Tone 4 Lip Color Matte. Mate? Matte. 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 Matt, I don't know how to say it. And the other product I order is this lip liner from Anastasia Beverly Hills. And that's it. Well, before applying my lipstick and my lip liner, I'm going to be um, trying on this uh, Tone 4 Shade and, and Illuminate Contour Duo. And this is the Intensity 0.5. Uh, I've been wanting to own one of these things long ago and I couldn't <laughs> let this occasion pass uh, at the Sephora event since I am uh, a Rouge member, I think is yeah, Rouge Thier or something like that. Uh, I have 20% when they have those type of events, saving events. And I like the way it comes with this little... Um, it's kind of velvety bag. I think it's a little velvety bag. It seems like suede leather, but it's more velvety. Yeah. This is the bag. I like it because it's also good for cleaning it. <laughs> now I don't see my fingerprints anymore. Look how pretty it is. Oh my God. So let's try this. And then after, yeah, after applying this, I'm gonna uh, apply my lipstick. This is how it looks like. This is the contouring color. I think this is a good color for me because I don't like it darker. So I'm gonna apply this with my finger. I'm not very good at contouring. Okay, we're gonna leave it like that. <laughs> Let's see how it works. I don't know if it changed color. I don't know if it oxidized. Okay. Let's do it. I like it. <laughs> Me gusta. Now let's do the other side. I like that the color is soft. What do you think? I really like this color on my skin. It, it looks very soft the way I like it. Since I don't like it too dramatic, <laughs> this is good. Mm. Before the lipstick, we're gonna do the highlight. The highlight looks like this. Wow, it's very light. I think this is perfect for a natural makeup, no makeup look. <laughs> now let's apply it here. Now a little bit here. Wow, okay, what do you think? This was the Tone 4 shade and illuminates in the intensity 0 0.5, 0 0.5. This is how the lip liner look like, looks like. And this is in the color peach amber. And this is how the lip lipstick look like. Oh, I really like it. 
<laughs> that's how we look like from the bottom and this is the top and this is the color look it has the tf encrusted in the top of the lipstick tf and let me uh, swatch it so you can see this is how the lip liner uh, look like let's see the lipstick i don't know i'm always afraid with lipstick i'm afraid i'm going to break them let's see if you if you if you will if you match well the lip liner is a little bit uh, brown and the lipstick even if it looks almost the same in the skin it changed to an orangey color yeah i can see the difference now the lip liner is a little bit brown and the lipstick is a little bit orangey well let's see how it looks on my lips very easy to apply i like it it's the first time that i uh, own one of the anastasia beverly hills lip liners and i'm liking it my lips are really dry what do you think about the lip liner this is how the lip liner looks i really like it i will see if they have a lipstick on this color <laughs> okay now i'm realizing that since i want to see the real color of the lipstick i shouldn't have applied lip liner all over my lips but it's okay now it's done <laughs> let's try this this is this is the first time i'm going to try a lipstick from tone 4 i only have uh lip glosses and also it's the first time that i'm that i'm trying an anastasia beverly hills um lip liner now let's try the tone for lipstick mm, what do you think I think it looks good with the blue jacket and the gray shirt. It gives a little pop of color. And I really like this color of lipstick. Oh, yes. This is the color I was looking for. And I was kind of afraid that, it, that I wasn't going to like it because I usually don't like to buy uh, lipsticks um, blindly. I like to go and try them because if I don't like them, I never use them and I don't like to buy and don't use and then give them away. <laughs> but I'm really happy with this color of lipstick. It's a kind of an orangey red. It's not red, it's also, it's not brown. But I think I did, I, I made a good choice buying this um, peach amber color from Anastasia Lip Liner and with this lipstick because i think it looks good let's open by the fireplace together and let me tell you what i think about it Well, I really don't know why the presentation this year is different. It has a lot of colors. <laughs> Previously, I saw this bottle at Sephora and the box was plain white with the buyer the fireplace right there, with the fireplace tissue right there. <laughs> this is a little description about the fragrance. The fragrance is from Replica, Maison Margiela, Paris, uh, the Toilette. This is 100 ml, 3.4 fluid ounces. And this is how the box looks like from the top. And this is how the box looks like from the bottom. Um, I think this is a new presentation because I remember seeing this box before and it didn't have all these colors. 
It, I think this is a refill bottle. The box is very simple, but it's okay. This is my first fragrance from Replica. <laughs> Esta es mi primera fragrance. Oh my God, I didn't want my bottle like this. Mm, it has all those colors. I think these colors don't match the bottle. Uh, this is more like, I don't know, a different type of, uh, I remember previously the bottle didn't have all these colors and I really don't like it. <laughs> Be, I'm being honest right now. I don't really like these colors on my bottle. I don't think it match. The color, the, the fragrance is by the fireplace. I prefer my bottle to be plain. I really don't like it. <laughs> I don't like the bottle. I don't like this presentation. I like the fragrance, but I don't like the presentation. All, all those colors, why? Why? Tell me why. I really like this. I would prefer my bottle to be uh, plain, just with the sticker at the front. That's how I like it. And that's how I thought it was. I thought this color was only in the box, not in the bottle, but it's just the bottle anyways. But um, I really don't like it. I don't. And I'm sure I'm not the only one. But it smells so good. But now let me tell you a little bit about the fragrance. I have the, the sample here. I decided to get this uh, fragrance because uh, I tried last year uh, a candle and I really, really like how that candle smelled, it smelled, but I really don't want to buy the candle anymore, anymore because that candle um, burned too, too, uh, too black. <laughs> I have a video reviewing that candle and the candle uh, burned completely black and all that uh, smoke, black smoke was all over my house. According to Fragrantica, that's the website where I'm looking at the notes of this fragrance. This fragrance was launched in 2015. Uh, it's not that old. Uh, and the nose of the perfumer behind this fragrance is called Mary Salamani. I'm going to uh, uh, picture here. <laughs> and the notes on this fragrance are cloves, pink pepper, orange blossom, chestnut, wayak, wayak good, juniper, vanilla, Peru balsam, and cashmere. <laughs> Those are the notes of this uh, by the fireplace fragrance. And I really like it. It does smell from here. I hope it's not leaking. Because I like my fragrances to last. <laughs> and I'm going to spray the, uh, the sample. Oh my God. <laughs> this fragrance is strong. It's an eau de toilette, but it's strong. And I, I already, I wore a lot on this sample. I didn't want to finish it because <laughs> I wanted to save a little for this video. But let me tell you what I think. This fragrance is really good. It's very smoky. And it smells a lot better on the skin than on paper. And I really like it. I just don't like it. I love it. This fragrance is, to me, uh, it's beautiful during this November and December month. October, November, December, I feel like smelling this all the time. To me, it makes me feel more like a relaxing time at home smelling like this. It makes me feel warm and I really love the smokiness and the burning chestnuts part on this fragrance. I don't feel anything else. Um, is woody, but it's that kind of a smoke woods. No, and it also 
I can also smell that type of uh, greenness. Let me see if I have a green note. Maybe, I don't know if it's the juniper berries or the Peru balsam, but it has something green on it to me. It feels smoky, but it also feels a little green. And I really don't feel the smell on the paper. So let me smell this or the bottle. There's not much I can tell you about this fragrance. Is this fragrance is being reviewed thousands and thousands and thousands of times here in, in YouTube. But this is one of the fragrances that you can buy at Sephora and that I can recommend to you if you if you like smoky fragrances. It smells so good and it lasts long. This fragrance lasts long on me. Even if I were if I was uh, wearing the little sample, this fragrance lasted on my skin maybe six hours because I didn't apply that much. I applied uh, half of the <laughs> of the tester. I will say this fragrance smells between six to eight hours. And if you want to keep on smelling it, you can apply it on your clothes, maybe uh, inside of your jacket so you don't stain it on top <laughs> or inside of your clothes so it, it lasts longer. But that only if you like smoky fragrance. Uh, another thing that I can say, if you wish to buy it, uh, you can go to Sephora because these fragrances are available. This fragrance is available at Sephora and you can smell it there. Uh, I will say you need to smell it before uh, buying the whole bottle because uh, it's a smoky and a lot of people don't like smoky fragrances. And that's all I can say about this fragrance. Um, I don't like the bottle. <laughs> I really don't like this design, this presentation. Uh, I will take away points for for presentation. Personally, I don't think these colors match the fragrance and I really don't like it. <laughs> I wanted my bottle to be plain, but the fragrance is, uh, is 10, to me is 10, but the presentation is probably a seven. <laughs> I don't like it, but the fragrance is beautiful. I really love it. And that's it for this video. I am really happy with my Sephora haul. If you have any question, leave it down in the comment section and tell me what do you think about all these products. <laughs> tell me what do you think about my haul, Sephora haul. And that's it for now. I will see you next time. Bye.